please read the disclaimer. Holy shit. That sounded like a fucking, like, ending. Like, a song you would hear at the very end. You, you just finished Final Fantasy Bingaling Bingaling. I don't know. You just finished a Final Fantasy game, and that's the music that plays at the fucking ending with the credits rolling. <laughs> that's what it sounded like. Anyway, welcome. I'm Bio, and this is Winning Post World 2010. Yes. This was released on the PlayStation 2 in 2010. This, is, uh, this was released by... Developed and published by Koei. Does come up with Temco Koei, by the way. Little logo. Did come up with that. Yeah, released in two, 2010. This is going to be interesting. I don't know what this is going to be like, by the way. Not a clue. Such emotional music. But I told you, didn't I? I said I was going to be playing a, a winning post game that came out in 2010 for the PlayStation 2. I think... I don't think this is the final... I'm just going to have a quick look. I don't think this is the final winning post game on the PlayStation 2. No, it is. This is... Okay, so this is the very last... This is the very last winning post game to be released on the PlayStation 2. That's impressive. Yep, the final one. Released in, it released in 2010. Alright, we're just going to have to wing it. I'm going to pick this second option. Hopefully it's... Uh... Okay, maybe that's lo that new game, load game, possibly. Let's see what this option is. Game previews? PlayStation BB unit. And game previews. Okay. What about this option? Oh, I like that. I like that little derby loading screen. That's cool. I don't know what... I don't know what this is. All right. Not that one. We don't want to... I don't want to... Okay. I think we're just going to have to pick this. We'll have to pick the new game and just see how it goes. I do like the lo the now loading with the little derby. That's cool. But I think we're just going to have to pick a new game and go with it. Um, this is very Japanese. Yeah, sure. I'm guessing we have to put this information in, then it will allow us to... That sounds good to me. I love the book. Normal. Easy. I don't know. Okay, I think we're good. It's a bit difficult navigating these menus, but uh, we're getting there. Okay, uh... 1983. Let's go to 2009. Yep. Whatever. Let's just go with that. I don't know what we're going in now. I do like the character models. 
they're cool. Remind me of the character models from G1 Jockey a little bit, artistic style. So, okay, yeah, so there's a lot, of, it's just like in G1 Jockey, there's a story here, you can interact with the characters, blah, 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 story about raising your horse, your horse. Um, I pick this. Yes. Yes. Uh, that one. I'm just picking fucking whatever, really. I think we just picked horses. I'm not too sure. <laughs> I'm not too sure. We've just picked some horses. Yes. Yes. I think they're questions. I think they're questions I can ask. I'm all good. I think it was just telling me things that I need to know about the game. <laughs> okay, so here's like the main menu. Um, race? What are we doing? Are we training? I just want to get into a race, if I'm honest. So, yeah, so what it seems like is the game's very similar to G1 Jockey. That one. Race. Race. You racing? Race. <laughs> Let's just keep saying race and hoping that we can go racing. God damn it. Eventually, we're going to go for a race. One of these has got to be a race, right? Oh, there's more options over here. Oh, okay. Sure, save. I don't mind. Save. We could talk to her. Okay. Gain something from talking to her. Alright, there's a lot of interactions in this. I wish to race. Okay, we're training again. Let the music. Besides the obviously RPG ending music. Okay, we gained something from that. I'm gonna pick this. We're talking. We've got another in another character interaction. Gain something from that. I'm going to pick the third option. I think this is more... I, I want to know whether or not there's actually any racing here. this dude one Mus the music sounds tense so makes me feel like I've got to do something tense I wish to race you this race I don't know, I don't know what's happening race <laughs> I don't want to race I just don't... I have no clue how to reach the, the conclusion of race. Gaining shit and doing shit. I'm gonna have a look. I'm, I'm just curious. Is there is there racing gameplay in this or not? I'm just really curious. Let's 
see how they never get the menus. Yeah, there is racing gameplay. Looks very similar to... Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, there is racing gameplay. I just don't know how to reach it. Something's happening, I think. I don't know. He's not happy about something. I'm just navigating these menus to hope that one of them leads me to a race. But I just don't think I'm going to get it. I'm going for each of these menus and I'm just... <laughs> now we're at the main menu screen again. <sighs> I'm getting angry now. I'm getting angry because I just want to race. And this fucking game just doesn't want me to race. Fuck you, game. Fuck off. Race, race, race. I want to race. Let me race. I give up. How long have I been playing this now? 13 minutes, and we have yet to get to race. Okay, here's the, here's the fucking trailer for the game, right? I can prove it to you. There we are. There's racing! Look, there's the race gameplay. The gameplay I couldn't fucking get to, for whatever reason. But there it is. There's the race gameplay. God's sake. I don't know how, unfortunately, I don't know how to get to the race, race gameplay. Whatever, it is what it is. I'm not playing anymore. That was winning post World 2010. Couldn't get to the race gameplay, which sucks balls. But you saw me navigating every fucking menu. Way too many menus. Honestly, Koei, fuck yourself. How many menus do you fucking want for your horse racing game? You cunt. <laughs> Alright, that's it. I've had enough. Goodbye.